I always found it funny when I was younger. I just hated walking. I just, oh, it's the worst thing ever. So my parents would take me and my sister on long walks and they'd oh, they always remind me how I would complain and complain about these walks. And I'd just be like, oh, how much further? Yeah. Whereas now I'd literally give my right arm to just go on a long walk. Yeah, I was the same, like, uh, my parents used to, like, drag us up Welsh mountains and, <laughs> I, like, at this time I was the same, I moaned and, like, didn't want to do it because I was just a little kid, but looking back now I feel, like, privileged that I was able to do that. Yeah, I look at, well, I volunteer at the neurology ward in Bristol and, um, I do, it does make you realise kind of, even though you are in a bad situation, how much worse it could be. And it does make you kind of take a step back and just think it's not the worst thing that could have happened to me, especially living in the UK with all the amenities and services we do have. Yeah. Um, what what you were saying earlier about um, like not giving people enough credit, like, mm. I, I think that's one of the things I've learned about being a worker, how nice most people are. Like, mm. it's very rare. In fact, I can't even think of a time where anyone's been like, apart from that Uber driver that one time. Yeah. <laughs> that was pretty bad. What but happened with the Uber driver again? He, he refused to tell me because of the wheelchair, even though he was a really big guy. Oh, wow. And yeah. Uh, and and he charged me a cancellation fee, even though oh it was him God. that refused. 